How's it going guys, Jace here back with another standard deck tech. Today we've got Soul Time Midrange. I want to try a little home brew that I've put together. This is basically a, you know, just a good mid-range value deck. We're playing some new cards as well from Outlaws of Thunder Junction. We're playing the new Oko. I really want to give this guy a try. You know, he gets to make a bunch of Elks, which is pretty good. I mean, the passive is also pretty good as well, like transforming into a creature with Hexproof. And then just getting there dealing damage. And then, you know, we're going to be committing lots of crimes in this deck. So the plus one's going to be very good as well. And then the minus five, it's okay, but it, it's not the best. So the minus one is what we're kind of using him for. We've got the Git Rog coming in as well. I'm giving him a try. Uh, tried him already. I do really rate this, actually. I think a 6-5 Trample Haste for five. Very good. And if you saddle him, you get a ton of advantage, which is really cool. And then we're also playing the full four three steps ahead in a mid-range deck. So I've tried this already in a Jeskai control list, and it was really good. And I was like, you know what? It's got so much good versatility. You know, you could use it as a counter spell. You could loot with it. You can create a copy of a token of a creature you control. You know, if you really wanted to. It's kind of got it all, which I kind of like. You know, I have played a couple of games with this already. There's a couple of times where, like, someone's going to kill a Shieldred and stuff like that. And it's like, yeah, you know, you can just drop counter, which is quite nice. Or you could be like, you know, they want to give you a Graveyard Trespass. You're like, hang on a minute. I want to get another copy whatever it is it can do it it's super cool i like it and then we got all the other like standard powerhouse cards that you've seen for a while right yeah go for the throat deep cavern bat make disappear so we've got eight main deck count spells i'm using assassin's trophy I, I love this i used to love playing this back in the day and i still think it's a great removal spell Shieldred, urtai glissa so stuff you come to expect and the lands obviously we've got a bunch of jewel lands we've got restless cottage we got the vine stalk to get in there and deal some damage on Channel lands now into the sideboard we've got anti-controlled uh, measures <laughs> with duresses we've got disdainful strokes we've got path of peril for you know small low to the ground creature decks another cut down another bit of cheap removal two more negate so yeah i really don't like control decks as you can see you can board in so much counter magic and then two long goodbyes one terra sunder which is good removal and another copy of shieldred if you do want to give this deck a try guys the deck list will be in the description below we're gonna play in a best of three standard rank game let's get into it Okay, uh, opponent going first. I'll keep. Uh, hopefully I'll draw land, but, you know, I can draw some cards. I've got removal, got counter magic. Uh, quite two expensive cards in my hand, but, uh, you know, is what it is. Yep. So we've got a surveil. Oh, maybe, maybe it's control. Maybe it's control. Who knows? Could be. Could be control. Potentially. It'd be an interesting matchup, though, if it is. Uh, I am going to... There's a creature, I think. Play as a creature. Don't really care if it dies. Obviously, I can draw a card. And stuff like that. But I would assume this is a control. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Besage you. At least I've got counter magic. There's not much else I can do. So I can just go rumble in. A lot of counter magic and... Pretty much it. Too much it. Yep. God. Go for a throw. Not great. Assassin's Trophy is good. You know, against Planeswalkers. A Wandering Emperor. Something like that. Which is always pretty handy. I'm just going to keep swinging in. Uh, there's nothing really for me to do. I mean, yes, I could try and get Shieldred down. Is that going to help me? No, because I'm going to no more lies it. Okay. Another Shieldred. Not the best. We keep getting in. Like. Memory Deluge. Yeah, I'm just going to counter it. I don't want their card advantage. People are like, oh yeah, you know, but what happens if they play something now? I'm like, eh, you know what, it's what it is. Temporary lockdown. At least I can assassin straight through that. Yeah. Oh. Which I will, of course. Count the spell up. 
Interesting. This might get hit with a get lost. Would be my guess. Yep. Okay. It's filled of ruins might be a pain as well. Had to get lost. Pretty good for them. Got two cars left. They do have the blue. Okay, they got very interesting. The tool doesn't mean we have to be overly serious. Interesting. Now, that is an interesting okay. fact. Um, do you want to play the? You play the get rock. Play it. Swing in. And kill to fairy. I think that's right. And we'll Uh, yeah. Pretty good one. Right, well, he can deal with the main man. I mean, I could attack them. But, uh, yeah, dealing with, dealing with the fairy is key. Still eludes me. Super important. Super duper important. Yeah, go for a throw could be cycled. A main phased a memory dilute. Now I could either play Shieldred, which doesn't really get the job done. I do you have the deep cavern battle? I forgot about that. I'll tell you what, let's deep cavern battle them. If take the sample. And I'm gonna attack for four. Uh, attack for four. Attack for seven. Put them four. I mean. Okay. And I've got a uh, tie up. Okay. Hopefully, didn't draw a count spell. He drew a get lost. Okay, count on that. What did they draw? Obviously, they draw off the earth eye. What did they draw? What should be a sunfall? No, no, my luck. What should be a sunfall? Like, I feel like I've played around this this game really well. You'll probably will get punished. What are you gonna play? Okay, they dig in. Also left their field of ruins untapped. Not great for them. Get rogs done well this game. Getting the job done. GG, right, go to game two. Alright, boarding in duress. Negate. Disdainful stroke. R uh, and Shieldred. Get rid of cut down. Get rid of the gopher throats. Uh Assassin's Trophy's fine. Get rock with amazing. And the Dread Knight's okay. Very your trespass is alright, it's kind of a pain for them to deal with. Um The Dread Knight? I mean, the Dread Knight's got some good kind of knowledge as well. Um, I kind of want to... A lot of counter spells. I kind of want to drop... Oko's very good as well. I don't want to drop any lands. Um, Deep Cavern Bat's also very good. I'll probably get rid of one three steps ahead. And... Probably one Glissa. Go with that. Alright, so that's the easiest mulligan ever. Okay, well, we have to mulligan to five. Okay, we have to keep. Get rid of the Rog. Get rid of Oko. Brutal. Mulligan to five. Luckily, we won the draw, not the play. And this is a control matchup, so it's not that bad uh, to mulligan 
that low. Because it is a... It's going to be a long game. You know, as long as I'm hitting land drops and stuff, it's fine. Okay. Else? Counter magic. We lost counter magic, which could be good. Do just keep hitting lands. And I could also do with hitting a cheap creature like the deep cavern bat. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Did they see a make disappear in that matchup? Yes, they did. So they know I got make this. This will also give me good information. Okay, so they did have a counter spell. I don't want to get rid of the counter spell. Because they're going to march. Counter spell back. Could take the march. They can just keep hitting lands until they get Wandering Emperor with no more lies back up. Be able to take the march. Take the march, because then I can just keep attacking them. And really, you know, annoy them. Or they could do the Soaring Sea. Okay. Oh. I'm just going to do the same again next. You just basically discarded the land. I needed a land there. Ooh. It's gonna cost me. That is gonna cost me. Yep. Same again. Got no more. Uh, we're gonna march it this time. Yep. So they're heavily relying on the uh, Wandering Emperor. Uh, I'm going to draw a card here, because I would like to uh, not get wrecked. Can't even uh, make disappear it. Okay. Cool. It didn't play anything. Okay, well I can also disdainful stroke the, uh, the Wandering Emperor. I need land. You know I mentioned that I just need to keep hitting land. I really need to keep hitting land. Okay, so they are firing it off. We'll go with this day. There we go. Get rid of it. Get out of there. Get out of there. Uh oh. I would have loved to have disdainful strike that. Um sure, I guess. I'm just gonna make disappear it, force them to tap their mana so I can get Shieldred down. Just in case they got counter magic. I mean they might not, but now I draw land. Kinda dumb. Could play Glissa. Glissa could be a good one. Yeah, let's go with Glissa. These are going to hold up the gate. Yeah. I mean, they can attack me. This one. Another land. Alright, my opponent's running out of resources, so I can start, you know, windmill slamming. Go we'll take five. The land, perfect. Keep these lands coming. Keep them coming. Go. Cool. Don't have to go for the throat to deal with the uh, the five five though. I can play Shieldred and keep Counter Magic up. Another Glissa. Oh, my days. My days. A memory of the deluge. Sure. I think my opponent's got this game. Yeah, me me stumbling on land for a few turns really hurt. 
And the mulligan to five, obviously. <laughs> that doesn't that doesn't help. Gain a mulligan to five. Disruption protocol. Okay, well I'm gonna kill that. Yep. Okay, so shouldered sticks. How long will it survive? Uh no idea. Probably not very long. Probably will get get lost. I would assume so. March. Okay. Then, I don't really know how I'm going to deal with this guy. If I'm being honest. Yeah. A little bit of memory deluge. Okay, well, they're, they're going for the kill. They are going for the kill. Unfortunately, yeah, stumbling on land. Mulligan to five. Pretty rough. Oh, I did draw the Assassin's Trophy, but then he's got the protection spell. Which is a bummer, let's be honest. He's not protection spell, but we can give this hex proof. Well, I will draw another card. Hopefully it's not another dud. Uh, okay. Alright. That's okay. I'm gonna Assassin's Trophy. Okay, he's not gonna go he's gonna go for that. Okay. Fine. I'm on one. Let's uh, loot. Huh, okay, well, that doesn't help. Um, let's loot again. We're going to a game three, but I'm just seeing what I can what I can find. Okay. We're going to a game. Th Kill the glisser. I'll load on my hand anyway. There's on the gate, or oh, whatever. Okay. Well, I don't know how I'm dealing with this guy. GG's. Yeah, I think I'm going to run it back. I mean, I, I, it was unfortunate. Mulligan to five. Brutal. And then getting stuck on land. It's, it just happens. Come on, give me a good hand. Give me a good hand. Yes, I'd like to play first. Okay, it's all right. It's not the best. It's not the best, but I'll take it. As long as I can keep it in land, I'm fine. I've been trialing out this deck for a bit, and it's, it always seems... I don't know. It always seems to struggle on land. I'm running 24. Maybe we should go to 25. Not too sure. Okay, land. Um, do I want... Does that mark? No, I, need, I, I, I want to be drawing cards. I want to be making sure I'm hitting my lands. Especially after what I've seen my opponent uh, do. Okay, I'm just gonna run out. I'm just gonna run out stuff. I'm just gonna force their. Ha I'm just gonna force their counter spells and their removal. You can get lost the glitter if you want. That's fine. Yeah, I got a creature heavy hand, so I'm just gonna keep slamming these creatures down. Deep cavern bat. Right, let's fire this off. Let's see. They probably will kill it. Stuck on land again. The running theme with this deck. So they've got two wandering emperors. A sunfall. Great. Great. Very difficult for me to deal with. Yep. I'll probably just deep cabin back. For take the sun. Uh, yeah, take the sun full. The god get Of course, of course I do. Of course. Of course. Land? Yay! Land? No. 
It is good though, so I will keep. This is the downside. Like I've got this count like I bought it in all this counter magic, and when I get turns where I'm stumbling on land. Is my opponent opening to cast a spell and I'm, I've got this situation, yeah? Where you know, I'm tapped out, I can't do anything. Yeah, my opponent's got free reign, it's pretty rough. We must protect the Okay, they did play the Soaring Sea. I mean, I'm not under much pressure right now, so I'm going to attack in. And now I can hold my counter magic up. Yeah. And I'm even going to cast this guy into the Sunfall. Look, opponent, you can carry him if you want. I, I agree. <laughs> oh, I really don't care. You're not winning this race with these two twos, and I've got a two-two life linker, and I've got other stuff. I'm happy. Just I need to be hitting lands now, of course. But uh, yeah, you're not winning this race. Just not. Okay. And I'm here in land. This is what I'm talking about. I'm here in land. Uh, and I'm just going to pass. You can cast the Wandering Emperor if you want to. Or well, they'll probably do. No, they got a memory deluge. Okay. Let them have it. Like I said, I can counter their stuff now, so I'm not too bothered. No. And if they play the Wandering Emperor, what are they going to do? Make a 2 2 and then I just got Assassin's Trophy here anyway. Yeah. Cool. Oh, they can't attack in anymore. Kind of duds. I'm hitting more and more land, which is great. So I am going to attack here. And, well, they got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I'm going to attack. Or do I just play... No, I can't play Shieldred. Um, I could attack here. Counter it. Seems good. Seems good. Just gonna block. They take two, they're going to very nice. They go for gonna go for some fall, probably. One, two, three, four, five, six. They go some fall, probably make disappear it. You know, if they don't play a land, some fall. They're not gonna play anything. Interesting. Alright, well, I'm just gonna keep playing land. Because that's exactly what I wanna do. And we'll get in. Another memory deluge. Okay. You've got it. Now what I don't want to do is I don't want to commit into the Shieldred. They got to get lost. March. They got rid of the Sunfall. Interesting. Interesting. Yep. Well, I think my opponent is still doing pretty well, right? They're on 14, they're hitting land drops, they've run apps, you know, they've got two memory delusions they could use. I'm not out of this yet. This could be oh god. If they have a count if they have a counter spell here, I am stuffed. Okay, well they didn't. Okay, well that's good for me. And I got a duress as well. Mm, beauty. Well, let's get in. Draw a card. Another deep cavern bat. That's also very, very nice. Interesting. This could be a turning point here. Oh, here's the thing. If they draw a board sweeper, I'm screwed. But if they don't draw a board sweeper, they're dead. I'm going for it. I'm going for it.
No Sunfall. Yes! Got there. That's what we're talking about. Wow, that was a really good game. That was a really good game. I managed to get there in game three. Blue Eye Control. Hey, look, it's, it, you know, Blue Eye Control, solid deck. There was times where I was struggling in land. This deck, for some reason, it's running 24 land and it does seem to struggle hitting this land drops, which is rough. I mean, like, you know, it could just be the, the game, you know, shuffling up and it's just how it is. But yeah, it is, it is quite tough. Uh, but overall, this deck does have teeth. You know, it can really go toe to toe with a control deck. You've got so many good, you know, advantage. And on top of that, you know, you've got so much hand disruption with the negates as well and the disdainful strokes, as you saw in that last game really do pay off so if you do want to give this deck a try guys like i say the deck list will be in the description below and if you made this far into the video guys and you've enjoyed it make sure to smash the like button and make sure you subscribe for more magic content all right guys that's it for me in this video thank you so much for watching i'll see you in the next one